Hello and welcome to all of our viewers from around the world. We have quite a game in prospect here, just waiting for the players to emerge and we will be underway. The teams then, Nigeria against Morocco. I'm your commentator Peter Drury and providing his unique brand of expert analysis, here's Jim Beglin. Hi Peter, always good to work with you. I'm really looking forward to this now. Can he score? It goes to show he is human after all. Well, he was in such a great position in front of goal and you'd expect him to score from there, but somehow he's missed it. Well, I think the early signs have been very good for them. They've already got that defence on settle and now they've got to back it up. Who's going to make this theirs? El Katori looks to slip it through. El Katori, great strike, but the keeper's equal to it. Plays it into the channel, cuts it out. Gets it back. So a third of the match, or thereabouts, gone, and we still await the first goal. El Katori played out to the right. it upfield Nigeria have a free kick and that's going to be a booking like a good ball through really well taken goal offside yeah the referee hadn't spotted his assistance raised flag he has now so he's ruled the goal out for offside a moment's uncertainty there but it is the right call Rain starting to fall here, it has been looking that way for a little while. Oh, good interception. If you have just joined us, you'll be glad to know that you haven't missed a goal. Now the pass. Chip through. Header! No, he didn't quite meet it right. I think he's done very well to get into such a good position in front of the goal, but he just couldn't put in the telling touch. Thrust towards the front line. He's a clever pass. Can he find a finish? Yes, he can! And right on half time, that is telling. I just think he showed a lovely appreciation of where that defensive line formed, and he held his run until just the right moment. And he broke the offside trap, and uh, he took full advantage. That's top marks for me. It's the whistle for half time. I'm sure they'll be very happy with the first half performance and the scoreline. They'll definitely want to maintain their momentum now and finish the job. Nigeria leading 1-0 at the break. 
Nigeria going well here and they're in a good position to kick on and add to their lead. They don't have to overcommit, but they can place more emphasis on stretching their advantage without necessarily neglecting things defensively. How about it? Danger averted for now. Yeah, he's fouled him there. And the ref's been lenient here. I doubt he'll get too many more chances. Yeah, well, they were exposed and, and vulnerable, and he knew he had to do something to prevent a goal then. And he's there to hoof it away. Tries a through ball. It's a very good battle there. Terrific to watch. It's a good run down the left-hand side. Great run this. He's covered quite a distance. Yeah, that does look a foul. Referee's given a free kick. Just a talking to, I think. Yes, it is. Passes it through. Morocco uh, keeping their men at arm's length here. Yeah, I just think it's a, a conservative move to deny runners the opportunity of, of going beyond that rear guard. Brought forward. What does he try from here? Promising move that, good inroads into enemy territory, but no joy. They've scored near to half-time to make it 1-0. He is not one readily to admit defeat, don't be surprised if he tries that again. Dira, spoon forward. Ruffled a few feathers, but well dealt with. Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. Referee's had to think about this for a moment, and it's a straight red. Well, there may be some scope for debate over the seriousness of the offence, but none over its repercussions. They'll have to see out the rest of the game with ten men. Just a few more moments for them to hang on. Deftly done. Defence has got rid of that. Loose ball, who's going to get that? al -Kaduri. And that is it, the referee 